Hello everyone and welcome back to Bendy and the Ink Machine. This is not Ink Machine. This is Dark Rival. This is Revival. All right, <laughs> let's go into what was it? Upside Down Hotel. Totally. It's kind of creepy in here. Boris. Hey, buddy. Oh, I can ring that. <laughs> okay. Oh! Well, thanks for the note. Bendy? Oh, I guess he can't follow me up here. I take it out on you! Filthy ink. Can I actually be, like, prejudiced against ink if I am ink? Is that a good thing? you want to question that no one questioned that that's the weirdest question but like a few episodes ago or videos or whatever you want to call them i i mentioned how i break the ink bottles just because it was something you're adorable because it was something fun to do but how i came across it was ooh, was that ink is bad and it's like the bad guys in this so i break all the ink bottles so there is no ink the problem with that theory is I am also ink. So, how does that exactly work? I I'm gonna wait for this guy to loop back around. Okay, I've waited way too long. Um, he didn't loop. Where'd this guy go? Oh, he's, like, going all the way down there. Dude, why are you... Why? Should have just followed him. There's no hiding spots around here, is there? Right there. So, if I literally crawl into here, I actually should be able to peer inside. Wait, Bendy, where are you going? I'll be right back. Okay, this guy didn't loop back around again. What is this guy's deal? Okay, hello? Oh, there are so many. Oh, there are so many. There are so many of you. Uh, maybe now the loop back around? Maybe? Let's just figure out. I, I don't. I don't want to do head on attacking every time. And so I want to kind of like play strategy wise, you know? Gotta, gotta figure out what I'm doing here. Gotta be all sneaky like. We're not alone down here. No, you're not. Bendy's right out there. This isn't happening. This isn't happening. He's also close by, so I'm not gonna go out. Yeah, see, there's your little. Weird gooey feet. Like, I'm not that gooey. Is it because I'm still part, like, human? Like, what is that about? How did you know? How did you know? How can you still hit me when I... I magically teleport and people hit me. It's not cool. But that also explains why, like, I haven't been eating meat. I've been eating like- Oh gosh! I've been eating like vegetables. Dude, were you sneaking away? Were, were you sneaking away? That's the weirdest thing. Can I- Hello? Did I- Did I not get it? Did I not get it? Search the town hotel. I never got the ID card? But I did! Did I not? Loop back around over here. Did, did I... What? Here, there's a thingy up here for food. Oh, I had food! It's fine. Did, did he not 
say that... Actually, what did he exactly say? Because he said it was right there, but it wasn't the safest place for it. Objectives. Search the downside hotel. Locate the Ghent building. Did I miss something? Where's, where's the letter? Where's the letter? I'll be right back. Okay, wait, wait, wait. So he says he put it in his room. So now I'm running into the problem. Why can't I access any of these doors? Like, I, I can't get in. He said it's one of the rooms. Yeah, so what am I supposed to do? Is there, like, keys? There could be keys on the people. Right? Keys? Collected slugs. Maybe there's keys on the people. Where would the hotel key be? Is there any more people? Oh, it's just a big maze, aren't you there, buddy? Just a big old maze. Do I have to search more things? I'm pretty sure I've opened every trash can and box. <sighs> oh! Oh my god. This my first week in the job at the Gen Workshop, and I can tell already that this is going to be interesting. Do you think you can lift this steel gun down? They asked me with a smug smile. <laughs> I didn't even bother the answer. I just picked the whole thing up with one hand. You should have seen the wee men drop their jaws. Uh, aye. Not at all. I've noticed this building just isn't built for someone my size. Every time I walk by the workshop shelves, all the tools fall to the floor. That, and I gotta bend down for every doorway in the place. So, there are some positives to working here. I mean, take that new secretary. The shy wee one with the blonde locks. The one who follows around Mr. Grey. I'm pretty sure she's been giving me and my muscles the eye. Fine, no smooth talker. A work worn man such as myself ain't got no business with a woman that fine. Okay. One, two, three, four. There, there has to be something. Like, that has to be a code. Like, if I tap the bell enough times, like, in a synchronous, it's like, one, two, three. I don't think that does anything but give me a headache. How do I search these rooms? Can I bust this off? I, I don't have keys. When did that get there? I've been up here. <sighs> okay. <gasps> oh my gosh. The game already told me. The game already told me. The keepers see everything. Dude, that's like a full Boris. Okay. That's... Well, geez. Whoa. You haven't gotten far. Don't do that. For real. Wait. How... how did you get in here? Oh, I have my ways. Is he a keeper? So tell me. The keepers I'll see everything. The Slow, but I'll get through. Ah. Am I? I see you have your father's never-quit go-getter spirit. Oh, now you knew my father. Well, newsflash, I didn't even know my father. Yeah, for real. Or my mother. Or anyone else in my family. Wait, what? I see then. You've chosen to forget the past. I can understand that. What? <sighs> what are you talking about? Am Look, I Joey's daughter? I don't think you're ready for this. But hang on to your lunch money. There's something I want to show you. What is happening? Wait, what are you whoa. Doing? Wait. I don't know if I want this. It's gonna go back to color. Just wait. It's gonna go back to a colored game. It's gonna be super funny if it does. 
All right, show me that color. All right, Joey. Joey, I'm here. I'm here. Henry. Let's see. That's who I played. That's who we played as in the first one. This is the beginning of the first one. Over here. Come have a seat. This won't take long. Whoa. Can I search things in this area? Dreams come true. Don't tell me I have to replay through the first one now. Do you know how annoying that would be? Oh, take a seat. Look, I have to, man. I'm sorry, but I got Where it. Where are we? Very old place. Full of memories. But never mind all that. There's a little story you need to hear. All right. You ready? Show me Henry. Go. Once upon a time, Audrey, there was a bitter old man who had lost just about everything. Yep. Joey. Right. The real Joey Drew. He blamed everyone but himself for his mistakes, but mostly yeah, he blamed like his old business partner for abandoning their work years and years ago. A man by the name of Henry Stein. Yeah. Great artist. That's who we played in the first friend. one. In his anger, Joey used an evil machine to create another world. A world made of paper and ink, where he'd torment his own version of Henry forevermore. But one day, Wait, so a Henry miracle happened. Wasn't actually Henry? An angel came into Joey's life. A young woman by the name of Allison Pendle. She didn't visit often. But when she did, she saw something good in Joey no one else could. Allison. Including himself. Like Alice. Through their friendship, he began to see the world with better eyes. So one day, in Joey's cartoon cycle of hatred, he gave Henry an angel of his own to guide him when things were most dark, to always provide hope. It was then Joey decided to make something new, huh? something he had always wanted but he could never have. A family, but not a cartoon one. Wait, Something so am I true? Joey's And after daughter? many, many tries, he created something that made him happier than he ever could have imagined. A wonderful, loving daughter. And he is Bright, Wilson from the kind, beginning. Almost human. Hmm? He created you, Audrey. What? What do you mean, are almost? You crazy? Listen, I know it's a lot to believe. Who do you think you are? I wasn't born from some machine. Flesh and, and blood. I'm not some kind of ink monster. Just because we're born of darkness doesn't mean we belong to it. We're always free to choose. To believe what we want to believe. Take me back. Right now. I'm not listening to any more of your lies. Remember who you are. Audrey. Leave me alone! <sighs> oh, interesting. Okay, so I called that. What? It's not true. It can't be. Oh, darling, it's true. And if it's not, that would be super... Okay, never mind. I'm so mad right now. I got the key card. I'm gonna save. I don't trust myself anymore, man. <laughs> I'm like... If I just dr drop down, will they know I'm here? Yep! Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna wait it out for a sec. Sneak attack. See, sneak attack. Wow, how did I not get damaged at all? That was absolutely amazing. I am the best that there has ever been. Can I teleport without them noticing? I can! 
Oh, this makes this so much better. Okay, I need to get closer to that guy. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, I'm almost there, come on. Dude, just slow down for five seconds, thank you. Okay. There should still be some people out here. But as long as they don't see me- Where's Bendy? Wait, 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 where's Bendy? It's fine. Bendy should just show up, right? Bendy? No, I can't leave without Bendy, man. No, 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 where's Bendy? Hey, you. Their reach is so far. It's kind of bull. Okay. Yeah, no. I don't think it has to do anything with, like, the size of the ink. I think it's just kind of random how much health they have. Where on earth is Bendy? Hopefully it's just a glitch. I better not have lost Bendy or I will be so mad. Okay. Gent. We are the keepers. The, the people with bags over their heads? You're the keeper. Oh, wait, wait, whoa. <gasps> Baby Bendy's bad Bendy? Baby Bendy's bad Bendy? I'm gonna have to kill bad Baby Bendy. Kill baby Bendy. I will. I will have baby Bendy as a friend. Oh. I don't like to ask questions. I believe everyone's got their own business. You hear something, you leave it alone. But when you spend as much time in and out of a jug as I have, you learn to keep your mouth shut about things, you know. So when I saw this year out in the newspaper that reads, Gen Corporation looking for research subjects pays three fifty a week. I figured it'd be good for me. Easy money, right? With my record, you can't afford to be picky. But it turns out something really wrong is going on in this place. I mean, I've seen dead people before. But here, death is like a way of life. A clockwork march. They wheel out the bodies, and they disappear down the chute. Forgotten men from the street, paid to die. 350 a week. Ah, uh, that sounds real messed up in so many different ways. Can I finally- do I have enough hexagon thingies? Oh, thank gosh. What is the next upgrade? Oh, you shock pipe to launch a disastrous series of heavy attacks. Finally! Can I go through that? No. No? I want to search the drawer, though. Fine. I, I need someone to smack around, though. I need a whack. Let's play some whack-a-mole, guys. Come on. Bring it. Oh, this looks like a boss room. Um... I'm the anomaly? I'm trying to figure that out as well. <laughs> My name is Audrey. What I'm is your favorite color? Look, I just want to go home. Please. 
Can you help me? Um... I think you're gonna Let's reach an talk. agreement with the weird devilly Who thing. Are you? The keepers. Yeah, I figured. Sixty-six. Oh. I think my joke was better. Who is the one, Wilson? You just served the machine, then. Where did you come from? Okay. Who made you? Boom. Can you take me to him? He wanted me to find him. I am where Wilson is. Please let me see him. I'm just gonna go through this vent as soon as you're done. Can I see him? Nice. Okay, okay, let me, let me, I already know where to go. Please just let me go. Okay. I like how to escape the toxic fumes. I'm going through the vent that's gonna get the toxic fumes. Like... Oh! I, I'm thinking I should hide for the majority of this. Yeah, I should stay hiding as much as I can. Because I don't think I'm ready to fight those things, though. I wanted a Fwampin. I did want a Fwampin. Uh, I don't want to go through that whole thing again. And I'm most likely going to die here, so... We're going to just do this. Okay. Whoop! You know what? Let's hide first. The eye! Oh, it's like the projector guy from the first game. Oh! Can can I do my sucky suck with these guys? Or are those tentacles gonna give me away? The tentacles gave me away! The tentacles gave me away. Peace! Okay, well, we'll find out who these guys are in the next part, because I can't damage them, so I just gotta hide and run. I love you all. I hope you're enjoying, and you have a great night.